and welcome to this video and if you're new welcome to my channel today I'm going to show you what kind of products I travel with and what I have in my makeup bag now this is my makeup bag I know it's big it's huge um, and I travel with this one everywhere it's heavy because it's full with products and I'm very excited to show you what products I always take with me when I travel. I'm not going to show you the brushes because I have brushes in another bag separately, not in here, because I have many stuff in here. So if you're interested to see what I have in my makeup bag, please keep on watching. Okay, there are a lot of products in here. So this is how this makeup look bag looks like. Let me open it Just like this. heavy and of course you can hang it if you can see take down here this and open it like this and it's full with products you can see so it can be st standing like this So let's see what we have here. These are the products I always tra travel with or some new product that I took with me during the Christmas. We went away and this is what I have with me. To remove my makeup I took these soft gently beauty formula soft gently soft apricot cleansing facial wipes. Ne they are not the best wipes ever but they do remove most of my makeup. So I use this. And then of course I took this one with me, Dermatoclen uh, Clarifying Toner. And also to remove my makeup, eye makeup, I took this Dermatoclen Eye Makeup Remover that I, I did a full video with these products, review these products. So that's what I have with me. Then I also took this uh, Concentrated Hyaluronic Filler with me and of course my eye cream that I use right now I also took this elasticity filler facial oil that I love and I used half of this bottle already and of course I had with me hyaluron filler day cream and of course the night cream too so that's my skincare that I use right now and I love it don't live without it so for my Makeup primer, face primer. I'm trying out this mattifying primer from Kix. Now, Kix is a Swedish brand. <laughs> it kind of reminds me of Sephora because Kix is a store, makeup store, that sells makeup from different makeup brands. But they also started creating their own makeup line that it's actually very good. The one product that is very popular here in Sweden that the most people really like is their primer, mattifying primer that I just bought and I'm trying out that primer so I'm actually liking it so it's a nice primer so that's that that is what I had with me during the Christmas week and actually liking that the foundation that I it's my favorite that it's very easy to use and travel with it's this cushion foundation from Lava Art compact cushion I actually took this one and also uh, because I didn't know how much left I had in here. I also took this compact refiller that I didn't use With me, so that's for the foundation. I also had this Re Revlon stay matte powder with me, but I can't really find it I took it out this morning when I was making doing my makeup So I can't find it, but I had that prime uh, that powder with me too also took this Laura Mercier primer uh, primer powder with me that's the primer. Then for contour, I took this that I, this is the only thing that I use right now for my contour. This is Wet n Wild Contour Palette, Dolce, this one. And I'm really liking this palette. I have a lot of product left. I used it a lot and I still have. For the bronzer, I took this Wet n Wild uh, Tiki to Brazil bronzer. Loving this bronzer. It's what I have on my skin today. Loving it. Uh, for the blush, I took two blushes, Wet n Wild Color Icon, this is Pearlescent Pink and Rose Champagne, these two shades, 
loving those. For the highlighter, I took this Makeup Geek Midnight Sun highlighter that I really, really like. Really love this highlighter. I don't have it on me today, but I love this highlighter. So that's the highlighter I had with me. For the concealer, I took two. I took this uh, Instant Anti-Age Eraser from Maybelline, Maybelline and also this LA Girl Pro Concealer. It's not my favorite, but it's not bad concealer. For the mascara, I took this superhero mascara that I got from, from my friend Valerie. So I took that mascara with me. And for setting spray, I took this Revlon Pro Fix Oil Control Setting Spray. And I don't have a lot of it left. I actually forgot to put setting spray on me today, so nice. Brush cleanser, I took this from e.l.f. I don't really like this brush cleanser. I have another that I love more, this one, uh, from also from Kix. But I, this was a big bottle, so I didn't take that with me, But so I took this one. And I also, something that I really, really like right now and enjoy is this Do Dr. Pow Pow Original Balm, so uh, soothing balm with natural pow pow. For lips, skin, hair, beauty finishing, uh, nails, fragrance free. I love uh, this product. I use it on my lips, on my fin on my nails. Uh, I use it on my hands. I love this product. Really like it. Don't, and I don't go anywhere without it. So I'm really liking it. For my hand cream, I took this with me. This is something that I also got from my glossy box, uh, Christmas edition, I think. This is the Body Shop Vanilla Chai hand cream. It smells, the smell is very strong when you first apply it, but it doesn't stay on for a long time on the hands. And that's what I like. I don't like hand creams that smells too strong. I can't stand it. Okay, what did we have with me next? Also a lot of bobby pins, a lot of them. A lot of uh, these too. I like to remove any, I like to remove any mascara that transformed them here with this one. I love to have these everywhere where I go. Don't go without these. Uh, I also took some uh, scissors with me and for eyeshadow palette. And I don't know why I always grab take this one with me wherever I go. I'll always pick this one. I don't actually use it at home as much as I would like it to. I did for the beginning, but I have a lot of eyeshadow make eyeshadow palettes that I kind of uh, switch between but this palette I always travel with and when I want to try another palette and, and travel with it I take the new palette but then I remove it and replace it with this one because it's so easy to use I create a many makeup looks and I love it it's this Too Faced Sweet Peach palette it smells beautiful and it's my favorite palette really really love this palette oh, I love the smell uh, yeah, I kind of really like this uh, Pure shade. No, this Bellini shade. This uh, Lush, this shade up here. I use a lot of these shades. This one, this brown. These two a lot. I uh, don't really like this Candy Peach. This this is the only shade I really really don't like. And this one too. This talk the talk derby to me these two shades i don't like but the others are beautiful love this palette so i did forgot one thing eyelash curler can't use mascara without an eyelash curler so i went and bought this one this is vedico vedico i don't know what brand it is it's a very strange eyelash curler forgot the one that I have at home, so I went and bought another one, but I like that it you, this handle that you can like hold it right, it's beautiful, but it's, I don't know if I'm going to explain it right right now, but it's too curved, so when I go on my eyelashes, I'm very scared that I'm going to pinch, my, pinch myself or hurt my eye, it feels very strange when I use this one, it, d it does an amazing job, but I have to kind of play with it more because I didn't, I'm kind of afraid to use it a little bit. It goes too close to my eyes and it's too curved. It's not, I don't like when it's too flat, so it doesn't 
grab for all the eyelashes but this one kind of scares me a little bit but it does work so that's good okay then I took these cotton pads of course with me uh, okay for hair no lips my new lipstick palette I love it use it all the time use it a lot I know there goes the brush I don't know if you can see but I did use a lot of this I did use this many times and then I, of course I use my new Kerastair shampoos I do take my sh own shampoos when I travel and I also took this Vatica wild cactus cactus deep conditioner hair mask love this hair mask and I also had one razor with me and Olaplex hair perfector perfector number three three I took that too with me so I think I think that was everything a lot of stuff uh, this makeup bag it's very nice it is a little bit heavy but I do like and I can take a lot of products with me because I do like having a lot of products with me when I travel my husband sometimes says it's too much but it's never too much for me uh, yeah give a thumbs up if you like these kind of videos thank you so much for watching please subscribe to my channel if you already haven't and see you in my next video bye